a back porch. What's going on everybody? It's Lance Money Cuts Press. We are on the final day of this uh, huge job. And we've got two little areas to do. Well, I wouldn't consider them little, but uh, two areas to do that are gonna need some work. We're gonna try to get it done in a reasonable amount of time and get it knocked out of here. So here's what we're getting into. And I'm just gonna show you, you already see it a little bit behind me, but this is what we got. Kudzu, kudzu, kudzu. Look at all that. Now this, I'm assuming they're not building over here due to the decline now. They can build on anything, but that would be my thought. And I mean, I'm six, I'm six three, and that right there comes up over my waist. So we are going to be cutting and hopefully trying not to hit anything. I see there's a lot of stuff in here, but uh, unfortunately, I got my truck right here. So if anything goes down, we'll be okay. What we're looking at is this is probably a full acre of kudzu with a creek bed in the bottom and uh, we're just gonna try to cut it back like we did in the previous video. You saw what I did with kudzu last time. Cut it back in the previous video, get it to where we can actually work from the bottom up, feel more comfortable doing it that way. And trying to cut it down to a point to where, you know, we're, we're able to see a clear difference. Get it, clear difference. <laughs> Anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna throw it up on regular for now so you guys can see how this stuff cuts. Uh, and then we'll do like always, throw it on a time lapse and let the rest of the world enjoy because I know they love a time lapse. So that's what we're gonna do. I'll start regular over here, this area. And then down here in this bottom is where we're gonna time lapse. And it goes way on back there. So let's just, uh, Get right into it. No time to waste. See you in a little bit.
Oh yeah. The kind of stuff you see. I mean, that's three days in a row. Three, three days in a row I've caught something. Of course, it just comes with a job, I guess. Let's get this thing cut out so we can keep going. This is what you run into when you're in stuff like this. I'm actually going to take you down once I get this out. There's a spot down there. I don't know how I didn't hit it or hit them. But there's probably seven or eight metal poles that you would drive in for just to keep a retaining wall. I don't know what they're called. I have to look it up. There's, there's seven or eight of them down there just all in one spot. Crazy. I sure bring my knife this time. stuff you deal with. You can't see nothing. When you can't see it, this is what happens. They didn't even spool them freely. Definitely going to have to sharpen my knife when I get out of here. I'm still plugging away. Still can't really spin it. One thing about these JCBs I don't like, one of the few things, is that they don't stay up. Notice how this head keeps falling down. I got a band adjusted. Every time you do the work on Nice, but I had it. Just the stuff you deal with. People's trash. This might not even be somebody's trash. This could be like a erosion. Something. But it ain't no fun. I'm gonna put it on a time lapse. We're gonna get this thing done. stuff right there is not fun I'm gonna put in a good pile somebody come throw it away anyways let's get right back into the action okay so I'm pretty sure this is like a drainage area ton of rock ton of silt I think it's silt tarp and then look at all this rebar look at all that rebar right there that's nuts but it's the stuff you see can't yeah and there's it's just nothing but rocks right here it's almost like this is where all the water goes but uh i'm gonna have to cut this from the bottom up can't really get to it from where i'm at anyways we're gonna get right back into it trash I mean, look at this it's a back porch Do this thing.
So let's talk about a few things here. Hey, my camera died. Apologize for that. None of my batteries. I mean, it, it's hot today, so it's just chewing through my batteries. But people, you gotta do better. This right here, stuff like this, trash. I mean, there's even, you know, culvert pipes, concrete, and all kinds of stuff. So, it's super frustrating whenever I'm trying to clear land because it just keeps getting caught. And I know that's just something a lot of you guys that do this for a living are gonna tell me, it just comes with a job, but I just don't, I don't like it because people should do better. I actually had a conversation with the HOA president about this area right here. And she told me I needed to come back later in the, in the fall and cut the rest of it, what her, her primary wants. She wants me to clear out up there at the top. And I'll give her my professional opinion on some areas that I can't do. Uh, there's some kudzu down in a deep bottom. 
it's going to need an excavator. Um, there's no other way around it. The, the drop off, I, I can't handle it with the skid steer. Uh, so I told her she needed to find somebody with an excavator with a mulcher or a cutter to do that. So it wouldn't be a bad idea to uh, be looking for that. But for the most part, it's night. End up. And actually a buddy of mine who cuts grass for the HOA, he, he cuts all this. He's gonna come back and blow it off for me. But uh, I cleared out down there. There's a manhole cover down there didn't see. They don't know where any of the manhole covers are. It's crazy. So the stress that comes with this job, you have to take your time. You have to make sure you're doing the right thing because this, this equipment costs six figures. And you just gotta make sure that you don't break it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey guys, it's Lance. Look, I had to clear this whole area out off camera. I'm gonna come back in the winter time and really cut it down a lot more. It was a beast to get even what I got done there. So I'm gonna let this timber die out and then I'm gonna chip, chip it down a little more. It's gonna be the last installment for a little while on this part, this HOA. If you like the video, don't forget to uh, like, subscribe, comment. It means a whole lot to me and it costs you nothing. If you wanna do that, by all means, this was a tough one today mentally tough physically tough just a lot of stuff that you got to beat around it's just something that comes with the job but it's just not something you're used to most of the time but uh you guys are awesome always have been always will be i'll see you in the next video i'm lance when he goes brush out